Hi, my name is Eva Galambos and I'm from Parlor X. I'm here at Mercedes-Benz Fashion Week interviewing the lovely Gal Saronda. How are you, Gal? I'm good, thank you. How are you? I'm very well, thank you. I'm very excited to see what you're going to do at Fashion Week. Thank you. Tell me about this collection and how it has evolved compared to your previous collections in the past. Um, well, um, this collection is titled Holy Water and I was inspired by the divinity of water, something that I've always kind of been inspired by, I think. It's, I've had that thread through a lot of my collections. Um, and um, I, I guess I like, was inspired by the idea of it being like a portal from one like, dimension to the other and um, the idea of, you know, the cosmic sort of circle and that symbol of the circle. And so um, like, it's my 10 year anniversary this year and I kind of just felt like it was symbolic of coming full circle or reflecting on the path that I've that I've taken and um, so that coming to my roots as well. So there's a lot of like signature things like for example like my monochromatic sort of style. But yeah. Are we going to possibly see a bit of colour in this collection or do we have to wait and see? Um, oh you'll see it in like the styling but yeah no not really. You're gonna just see black and white in this collection. Fantastic. So, yeah. Well that's your signature. Yeah. And I love the fact that you always remain true to your signature. I think that's yes. really important. Yeah. Definitely Gal Saranda is one of those collections that is identifiable. Yeah. Um, after ten years, ten years, I mean that's just yeah. fantastic. And to be cel celebrating mm. twenty years Fashion yeah. Week and ten years your own business. Yeah. Tell me about how you, you feel, you know, the the birthday. Um well I guess like it's kind of like, I guess I've just been sort of like reflect, I went through my archives actually um, recently because I had to um, do something like, where I had to like pull out a few of my own older pieces and so then it just got me like thinking about it as well like um, some of the pieces even from my first graduate collection because um, I won the Mercedes-Benz Startup Award and that's what launched me um, into Fashion Week and that was with my graduate collection so and that was called um, Angel at My Table and um, I remember that. Do you? Yeah, yeah. I do. Yeah. 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 And like I um, I remember I, I still wear some of those pieces mm. like now and I have customers who say they still you know they still wear them as well and they're still special so um, that I can't yeah that kind of makes when you reflect on that like it it means that you know pieces like kind of evolve yeah evolve but they're still like retain. irrelevant yeah. yeah well for me they do yeah. well I think that's the interesting thing about your di design aesthetic it's not necessarily trend based it's very creative it's avant-garde but it's very it's very signature and reflective of who you are and where you're at yeah. now you've lived abroad yeah. you've traveled abroad you've succeeded abroad you've done some great collaborations yeah. tell me about how how you feel about being Australian and about presenting at Australian Fashion Week um, I think yeah, like we're we're all part of a global community. Like we, you know, we might be geographically isolated, but you know, these days we're like we're part of the techno consumerist sort of society where everything's at our fingertips. So, um, like I think it's important to travel and um, to see other perspectives, other cultures, and um, I think as a designer, like you have to be sensitive to that, and and it's it's good for your creativity, and um, and I'm so glad I've. I've done that and I will hope to continue to do that but um, yeah there's something also very signature about Australia and um, and being Australian and so um, and you kind of understand that more and more the more you see sort of like outside outside of that sort of, outside of our geography but um, I think it's important like it's nice to do something local um, and and sort of like and think global so I agree. Yeah. Well, thank you for that. That's yeah. given us a great insight into what you do. Yeah. And now you. we take it to the runway. <laughs>